Hi, Lynn McDonald here and today what I'm going to cover is follow up. How to follow up when you're posting your products. Uh, follow up on comments and likes. So here we can see my Facebook and this little bell here is what's called your notifications and there's someone there liking the products in this little shop here. So all I do here, because this is my group, is I just say, hi, Louise. Tag them if I can. Let's take that away. Just let me... Now what you're creating here is interaction because the more interaction, the more people who will see it on that little notifications on what we call the homepage. Uh, so you, you just really want to let her know it is for sale and if she wants to buy any or he, just let me know. So that's that one done. And then, oops, what I do is I hide the notifications that are not relevant to me. <laughs> she obviously likes them. And my iPhone doesn't always allow me to tag them. Sorry, yeah, it's Anne Rich. I had to check her name there. Start again, Lynn. Oops. Thanks for the like. If you would like more information or would like I would normally just say if you would like to buy or like to order but because there's three products she might be just interested in one but the most important part is I always 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 promote my online shop um so if they, they like the products um you pr sorry, if they like it or the comment, always promote your online shop. Now, whether I'm using the iPhone, it doesn't actually open up my cover photograph on the phone. But it does give them a link. And people do join from this link. Two or three people should join your group a day. And this is how I grew my team, my group rather, from... Around about a thousand up to two and a half thousand over just two or three months simply by doing this. Now you'll see here all it does is highlight it so that you can click on it. And we'll just go back, we'll just refresh it. Oops, I must have misspelled. Well, it doesn't help if you misspell. I haven't, I'm not wearing my glasses. Which is really bad if you're doing trainings. You can copy and paste this, but if you're doing a lot of them, you'll end up getting a wee Facebook warning. Yeah, and that's how it should look. <laughs> And it takes them right through. And you will find... Now, if you're doing that on a laptop uh, or a PC, it will open up this here, this cover photograph. Um, so quite often with my likes, I do prefer to do them on a laptop or a PC. And what I'm trying to find here while I'm talking to you is... Uh, where did I put that? Let's go back. Which group was that in? West Lothian. All I'm going to do is just find this group on my laptop and see if it has opened up that cover photograph. But what you will find from just doing that... Sorry about this. By just doing that... You'll get more people to join your group. Sorry. I was meaning to have the pages open, but I didn't know which comments. Just want to see things for sale. 
and we're slow then. Two minutes and we'll show you, hopefully we'll show you in a wee second what that looks like on my laptop. Taking a bit of time because obviously if I'm responding to notifications, I didn't know which ones I'm going to respond to. And obviously you wouldn't take this time. I'm just wanting to show you what happens. Hopefully it worked. That's why I like to do it. Just find the product here. While I'm doing that on the laptop, I will go and respond to my other adverts. She shared it. So hi, Tracy. Is that the person who liked it? Tracy Toy. See, that doesn't all Tracy Toy. Try and take a mental note of who you're tagging because what happens here, you can see something that doesn't allow you to tag them on the iPhone. Nope, let's just make sure I've got the name correct. JC Wene Toy. Use the apply button, see if that works better. I think that's what I did wrong there. It says reply to JC Toy, so I'd imagine that's going to ta tag her. Thank goodness for spell checker. <laughs> In the meantime, I've actually got my shop saved, which is what I should have used. And that will go through to your shop, and you will find that, as I say, you will get people. Joining your group from that, and what all I'm trying to do now is keep going down them. Louise likes your comment, likes your post. We've already dealt with that one. She commented on it. She commented on it. We've dealt with these ones. Wait a minute. And all I'm doing is I'm getting rid of all the tags that I don't need so that I can see clearly who's commented or liked my products. And if you want a training on how to consolidate it, consolidate the sales, <clears throat> then you'll find that on the System for Success playlist. So that's how you look after your notifications. And all I want to do now is just quickly find in fact, what's easier to do is just go to Linmax uh, online shop for you because what I want to do is I want to show you, although it doesn't open up when you put your group, it doesn't open up your cover photograph on the phone. However, if someone's using a laptop or a PC, it will. Oops, I just need to... I keep forgetting when I'm doing my trainings, I've actually got them. This is done in what is a... It's like a, a text replacement. It's called on um iPhone. You can get the text replacement. And all I did there was XS, and it shows you my online shop address. Now, what I've done in, on the laptop is I've came to that product and see if it has opened up my cover photograph. It's not showing yet. It's a little bit of time delay. And then that'll be the training finished. I want you to see how it looks. That's the comment I just put. So if it's on a laptop or a PC, it actually opens up your cover photograph. That's the training finished. Thanks very much for your time. Any questions, please ask.